Hi guys, this is Ranger Rob. It's actually a late video for me to be making because you ever had one of those days where nothing went exactly the way you expected? Good, bad, or indifferent. So, uh, this morning I always do my normal stuff with the radio stations. I have to upload and, and move uh, people, turn files into me. Um, for radio shows and then we put them on the radio stations and we have three of them so I got through that pretty typical uh, scenario and uh, what the heck <laughs> sorry somehow <laughs> it's been really windy here I got a hummingbird over here <laughs> I don't know how I even got here. So I, um, I got a phone call after working in the morning that uh, my son was going to bring the grandkids over, which is as, when that happens, it's drop everything. And because uh, uh, we always love having the kids over. And we had this wind sprawl come through here. Got kind of funny looking clouds out there, too. But uh, anyway, uh, as we decided we'd go to lunch. And first thing, uh, my son says, your, your gate's acting weird again. And sure in the heck, it broke again. And you saw it around when we had snow that there's so much torque going on here that uh, uh, these are literally down here are shearing off. It's like, that must take a lot of pressure to shear off. Right? And of course, I go to buy bolts, and they were too short, and I ended up buying, going back and buying more short uh, bolts. And I have to do a build up here because if this is in too much, this gate won't close properly. So that was a pain in the butt. And of course, my wife decides to call in the middle of all this, and there's a church event going on tonight, and our minister is doing a really neat program, which sounds great and interesting, but. I can't let that gate not operate properly because it wouldn't it close and then open up a little bit because it was going too far. It's hard to explain. So it's like, I can't go to that deer. So she went. So I'm alone this evening, which is fine, but I get to see the grandkids. And uh, <laughs> anyway, so after going to the store twice, uh, uh, shop, um, I managed to get the right bolts, had to reassemble it like three times to get the washers just right, and it finally worked. And, uh, cause I, I don't like it when people don't take care of their dogs and stuff like that and keep them in the fenced properties and stuff. So there's no excuse for me to not make sure my fences are working properly. But the other thing I haven't done yet is we got to get the eggs for the chickens. So, I did grab my uh, little basket. Thought I'd swing by, uh, let you know that the little uh, tomatoes are starting to sprout. And then Sherry's doing a little experiment with uh, perlite. And then I messed up on my uh, broccoli. Uh, my lights were too high, so they got too long. And... Uh, I think I did the same thing with uh, the radishes. Uh, I might get some radishes. And I had a little trouble with uh, having the lights too far up. I watched a show on uh, uh, Homestead Traditions, I believe it was called, um, where they said they had their lights too low and the plants weren't happy. So I was being ca cautious. So I put my lights up higher. and. Uh, my <laughs> my seedlings weren't happy about that so i did lower them so <laughs> anyway so today turned out to be a little bit more chaotic than i expected it to be in a good way in this darn windstorm sorry about the wind but uh right i mean this morning was like a gorgeous beautiful day took the kids around showing what grandpa and grandma have been building back here and then we went to lunch and came back and it's blowing like crazy. 
and uh, gate's broken. And it's like, oh, and I haven't got my eggs yet. And uh, now I've already checked to see if the chickens need any food and stuff. So they're uh, over here going, dude, you need to get your act together. <laughs> so I'm going to take you over. Wow. They're digging some holes back there. Uh, this time of year, they start digging and dusting themselves really good. So, got to be careful they don't dig too big a hole. But let's see how many eggs we got. I'm going to try to do this with a camera on. But there's two there for you, the new people. Each egg in the over here has a, hi, um, has a uh, ceramic egg. So, let me gather these up and uh, uh, then check the feed. Got uh, 10 eggs today. Right here, all beautiful eggs. And yes, my girls need some food, so I'm gonna feed them. Alrighty, well, we got the girls all fed. They're happy, the water looks good. Got lots of eggs, got everything cinched up. Getting late in the evening. And uh, my phone's ringing, hold on. And I am back. There's Sherry on the phone, everything is cool. I am so out of, I'm Twitter paid it. I like to, I didn't realize how much I like to be organized and have a pattern. So when a pattern in my life gets kind of disturbed, uh, it, it's not a bad thing. No. Um, but you don't realize how much you're getting in a rut or whatever until uh, your pattern of things get disrupted. And mine was disrupted for a good reason, but the, the fence gate problem was not the good part of it. The grandkids were. And uh, they got to try some freeze-dried pineapple. And it was, all, it was all I could do to keep them out of it. And so that was really cool. So uh, I found them a nice treat. They, they never know what they're going to get at Grandma and Grandpa's. So anyway, that's the wrap up my day. Kind of a quick video uh, to keep the saga going. Got to take my eggs, get them all put away, and uh, <coughs> simmer down. And... Uh, be grateful for everything I got and be grateful I got to see the grandkids today and have lunch with my son. And uh, it was a wonderful day. So uh, uh, that's all I care about. So guys, please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. And uh, uh, be safe out there. And uh, we'll talk to you later. <laughs> Bye. Our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags. Available at Amazon right now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.